Hello guys, today we'll be, we'll be reviewing a movie called Zero Storm. It is a movie that came out two years ago and it flopped. Just telling you guys, because if you all got here, about this 120 million, box office 121, 221 million, so much they watched at least 40 to 50 million dollars on the movie. It's basically a movie where a bunch of natural disasters threaten the world, and the world leaders basically create a bunch of satellites to control the, the, to control the weather. And but now some guy hacked into the system and uh, and is signed as Mars to basically that has been built to protect us is now attacking it because spoilers later on someone else was actually the one who gave the command to do all this stuff to happen in the movie. Um and becomes a race against the clock to uncover the real threat before a worldwide Zero Storm wipes out everything and everyone along with it. Basically, they were a movie. This is actually a pretty good movie. Um, don't believe what <laughs> this is. An, it is just like Suspect Zero. The critics gave this movie such awful reviews. Um, no, I don't want to play the trailer on YouTube. Um, this is much better than uh, than <laughs> Then the last did I and then then, then the, the critics will go and give the last day a 96%. The last did I is a 16%. Okay, the last day should be at this score, but they gave the last did I a 16%. Um, this movie is this movie is one of the, those types of movies you either love the movie or you hate the movie. What's this one of the reviews basically described? There are people who do, who hate the movie and don't want to ever, want to ever see it again, and there are people who love the movie. Um. I thought the plot was actually pretty good, um, in the movie, um, the acting was okay, um, the CGI was actually pretty okay for this movie, um, the, the CGI was this is okay, but when, especially when you compare it to a movie like Justice League, where Justice League actually doesn't have that great CGI, but the scenes are still, fight scenes are still pretty great, um, this movie is definitely better than other movies that came out this year, um, Divergent, but and Death Note we make yes they made we they really we made Death Note this year. Um, you can I wonder why um the movie this movie is has uh. so if you like a movie basically some people didn't like this movie because there wasn't enough things being destroyed. I thought this movie was fine. It was. It was entertain. It was actually pretty tense at the end of the movie, um, and that's basically it. This movie is good. Um, you can if you want to go see this movie, you can. Um, definitely is not as bad as people make it out to be. Overall, I give the movie around a seven out of ten. Um, same score I gave on Justice Week because. This movie does have its problems, but I don't think it's problems. I don't think it's a three out of ten movie. Um, a three out of ten movie is The Last Jedi. Okay, that and it came out the same year. Um, I would rather see this hundred times and see The Last Jedi a hundred times. So overall, Zero Storm was a pretty good movie. The part is that the storyline is actually pretty good. Um, and the characters are actually some of them. No, so I'll pretty like more, except for the guy who wants to put. Who wanted? Who caused the storm? The who caused the events to happen to begin with? And that's basically it.